Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet a pebble stitch skirt. So let's get started. To make the skirt, I'm working with a 55 millimeter crochet hook and worsted weight yarn. Start with a slip knot. And you're going to work a foundation chain that is long enough to wrap around the largest part of your hips. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to crochet a chain. And I'm going to work this skirt in the pebble stitch. And the pebble stitch is a double crochet and a single crochet. And the next row is a single crochet in the double crochet and a double crochet in the single crochet. So I'm just going to work a small section here. So after you have your foundation chain the correct length so that it wraps around your hips, you're going to need it in multiples of two. And then you're going to slip stitch to join, being careful not to twist the chain. So a slip stitch to join. And this will be the bottom of the skirt because by using the foundation chain as the bottom of the skirt that will prevent it from stretching out. So after slip stitching to join, chain one and single crochet in that same stitch. Double crochet in the next stitch. Yarn around the hook. Insert your hook into the stitch. Pick up the yarn and pull it through. Pick up the yarn, pull it through two. Pick up the yarn, pull it through two. Single crochet in the next stitch double crochet in the next stitch, single crochet in the next stitch. You're going to repeat all the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around working the pebble stitch. I ended here with a single crochet. I have a single crochet as my first stitch, so I'm going to finish the row with a double crochet. And I'm going to slip stitch to join in the top of that single crochet. So I ended here with a single crochet and that's a double. So a pebble stitch means I make a double in the single and a single in the double. So to start this row I will chain two, one, two. And that's going to count as the first double crochet. There's my next stitch and it's a double crochet. So I'm going to single crochet. I'm going to double crochet in the next stitch single crochet in the next. You're going to work all the way around. Double crochet, single crochet, double, single. You're going to work all the way around. Okay, I worked all the way around. I ended with a single crochet, and that was the equivalent of my first double crochet. So I'm going to slip stitch to join in the top of that first chain two. So slip stitch to join. So for the next row, I'm going to chain one, and I'm going to single crochet in that same stitch. And there's my single crochet. I'm going to double crochet in that stitch. I'm going to repeat all the way around. There's my double. So I'm going to single crochet, and there's my single, so I'm going to double crochet. And you're going to repeat all the way around, then slip stitch to join, and just keep repeating those two rows. When your skirt is finished, you can pass a cord through. I passed it through the second row. Just pass it all the way around with just a safety pin, and you could tie that. Or for a skirt for a child, you could pass some elastic through. Or some ribbon. And there you go, that's how easy it is to crochet a pebble stitch skirt. Thanks for watching, bye for now.